Let's convert from interval to plus minus notation, a notation that you're probably going to see more commonly published in most newspapers or other public uh, data. If we remember from StatKey, we had our middle 95% was an interval from 0.45 to 0.75 when we were looking at that one proportion. So from 45% to 75%. That's an interval from a start point to an end point. To do plus minus notation, you start with the middle. So in this case, uh, it would be 60%. And then we say how much it's going to vary in each direction. So it's 60% plus or minus some amount. And let's go ahead and go through the math here. So first thing is to figure out where the middle is. And the middle is always just the average. You add the two ends together and you divide by 2. So 45 plus 75, you add those two together, you get 120. You divide 120 by 2, and you're going to get 60% is in the middle. Then you have to figure out how far uh, you go in either direction, and that's your margin of error. I like to also call it the wiggle room. So your margin of error is what it's technically referred to, how much wiggle room you have on either side. And to do that, you just pick uh, one of your two endpoints. It doesn't really matter which one uh, because this is in the middle. So let's say that high end, that 75% minus the 60% in the middle, and we're only going to vary by 15% on each side. So we start with the middle. Say how much we vary in each direction. 60% plus or minus 15%. And if you do the math of the plus and the minus as two separate problems, 60 plus 15 is 75, 60 minus 15 is 45, that's how you know you have the right interval. You can do this with means, not just proportions. So let's try it with this one with means. We're 95% confident it's between 6.8 and 7.4 pounds. Well, first let's start by finding the middle. We take our 6.8 and we add our 7.4 and divide by 2. So we're just finding a simple average of these two numbers. And if we do that, it's going to be 7.1 pounds. So that's our middle. Once we have the middle, we have to figure out how much our margin of error is, how much wiggle room we have. So I like to take the high end, 7.4, and subtract our middle. So 7.4 minus our middle of 7.1 and that's going to equal 0 0.3. So that's our margin of error. That's our center. We always say our best guess, our middle, 7.1 plus or minus our margin of error, our wiggle room, 0 0.3. And we always like to put our units on there, so pounds. If we do the math, 7.1 plus 0.3 is 7.4. 7.1 minus 0.3 is 6.8, so we know we did it right. And we could use this in a sentence saying something like, we're 95% confident that the average weight of the golden doodle puppies is 7.1 uh, plus or minus 0 0.3, or within 0.3 of 7.1 pounds. And we'll go over how to construct those sentences in a moment.